Hi guys, today I'm going to be talking to you about how to calculate a drip rate for an IV set. So, um, this is a very simple equation once you learn it, and involves just um, a bit of multiplication and division. Sorry about um, the funny angle here. Anyway, on the top of your division line, um, right here is going to be where you put your amount um, that you're going to be uh, administering. So let's say we have a 1,000 milliliter um, bag of saline. Okay? So this would be NaCl 0.9%. This does not matter. This is just so you know what it is. So on this side, you're going to have the quantity that you're going to be administering. I'm going to do a multiply. And this spot here is going to be the drip set that you're using. So generally, if you're using a standard drip set, it's going to be um, uh, 10 drips per milliliter. If you're using a mini drip, it's going to be 60 drips per milliliter. Um, so this number is either going to be a 60 or a 10 to base, basing on what you're going to use. But we're going to put a 10 here. This is, we're going to use a standard adult drip set, so it would be 10 drips for every milliliter. And then on the bottom here is going to be how many minutes um, you want the infusion to go for. Not the infusion, but the, um, the administration. Sorry. So let's say we want this bag uh, to last us 2 hours. So we're going to put in minutes, so 120. Okay? <clears throat> Excuse me. So, now we basically have to multiply this together, divide this, and that'll give us the drips uh, per minute. So, we'll just do some division here. We can cancel out these two zeros. Um, and then we basically, 1 times 1,000 is 1,000. So this is gone. Then we basically have 1,000 divided by 12, which equals 83.3 three drops per minute. Now you can't really calculate 0.3 drops so we're going to round it so this would become 83 drops per minute. And if you're looking, um, if you're doing medically speaking, this would be GTTS um, per minute. So if you wanted to inf uh, administer 1000 uh, milliliters of saline over two hours within a standard 10 drip set um, you, would you would end up being 83 drops per minute hope this was helpful to you guys and broke it down a bit um, have a good day